All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James, I'm Nobu. and today we are going to be watching Band of Brothers Episode 1. So, we finished Chernobyl. Uh, I figured we would do another kind of like historical mini series. I, I don't know why I thought of Band of Brothers, not really the same time period or anything like that, but I just, it seemed right. So, English band formed in 1986 in Kimberley, Surrey. The band originally consisted of Shish. Hey, Siri. And then be quiet. Okay, well, Big Brother's listening. Um, Random. <laughs> anyway, we're watching this series now. Um, do it in episodes every week, just like Chernobyl. So, uh, episode one, full length reaction is going to be up to Patreon. Next week's reaction, episode two, is going to be up for early access if you guys want to go ahead and see that. And yeah, thank you just for being here. Thank you for joining us for watching. And let's just get into Band of Brothers episode one. Go. <laughs> Do you know anything about this show? No. I okay. Know. I think I have seen maybe the first episode or two. I'm not sure though. Okay. Zora told us to put our uniforms on. I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? He says the USA is in a war with Japan. Where I come from, but uh, we a lot of us volunteered. Who would like to volunteer for the tank? Oh, yeah, corps? you would. Who would yeah. like to volunteer for the Air Force? I like that they're putting the real interviews in. And then uh, they said, who would like to volunteer for the Airborne? So we said, what the hell is the Airborne? Nobody ever heard of it. We came from a small, small town in that town where, that where four F committed suicide because they couldn't go. Jeez. Wow. Different time. I did things. I didn't wow. do them for medals. I didn't do them for accolades. I did them because they... Army equipment, you jump out of airplanes uh, to fight the enemy. They said, go to hell. Nobody put up their hands. <laughs> well, because that was a very new concept. Oh, really? In World War II it was? Yeah. yeah. And, but you get paid $50 a month more. <laughs> <laughs> that means 100 bucks. <laughs> like, hold up. <laughs> it's cool how they're, they're combining some of the real footage, too. Is this, like, based off of, like, an actual, is this, like... Uh, you guys would have to tell us in the comments. I'm not sure. It might be based off of uh, some of these men here who, who are being interviewed loosely. I, I'm gotcha. not confident about that at all, though. It's an interesting choice to have this effect of, like, um... I mean, I don't know what it's called in film, but like, you know, in animation, like where you go to the frames. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It gives it a, an interesting kind of vibe. Yeah, it does. I, I really like it. And it makes it look like they're pictures, right? There's yeah. like little fold creases on the film and stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, it's very cool. There's a lot of actors. Uh, I, I'm not even going to know a lot of their names, but. But you'll recognize, I'm sure you'll recognize some of them just because they're in lots of stuff. You know what I mean? I mean, hopefully. You always no, have I'm that not. massive, like any military movie, they're like, oh, we need every guy in Hollywood ever. Great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh, we're jumping we're, straight we're into late. it. late, yeah. Normandy? I thought we were going to start a little before, like... Yeah, I thought we would have started like we're a little bit earlier. some training or something like that. Because they were talking about, like, they were just getting recruited or something. So. Yeah. I mean, we maybe we will. Who knows? We might flash back. That's true. It might be that. The Channel Coast is socked in with rain and fog. High winds on the drop zone. No jump tonight. Dang. The invasion has been postponed. That's what happens sometimes. Yeah, bitch. Two sergeants, <laughs> take charge. <laughs> Four o'clock in Chicago. Happy hour, huh? <laughs> civilized place for civilized men. Should have been born earlier, Nix. <laughs> what, and give up all this? We'll go to Chicago. I'll take you there. Yeah. We'll see. Yeah, this is not over yet. Actually, you know, it's from there. Oh. Oh, him. So 112 days of that son of a bitch, and here we are. <laughs> oh, there we go. Hmm. Okay. 
Yeah, poo. You people are at the position of attention. <laughs> well, here's the other guy from Chicago. <laughs> Private Picante, have you been blousing your trousers over your boots like a paratrooper? No, sir. That explained the creases at the bottom. Volunteering for the parachute infantry is one thing, Picante, but you've got a long way to prove that you belong here. Your weekend pass is revoked. Oh, jeez. Dang. Lord Judge. Dirt in the rear sight after your pass revoked. Dang, dude. When did you sew on the chevron, Sergeant Lipton? Yesterday, sir. Long enough to notice this. Revoked, sir. <sighs> Man, malarkey, Donald G. Malarkey, malarkey slang for bullshit, isn't it? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Rust on the butt plate, hinge spring, private bullshit. Revoked. Now, thanks to these men and their infractions, every man in the company who had a weekend oh, pass gosh. has lost oh, gosh. it. Gosh, I feel bad oh, for those guys no. that had the infractions. Yep. Why don't you come here, look at these trousers, get down, and you tell me if there's a tree All right, song. let's go. On uh, PT formation, let's move, move, move. Conte, let's go, Conte. Is he going to go? Okay, good. I mean, you got to, right? Otherwise, yeah. You're... Why are you not in your PT gear? <laughs> Do not help that man! Do not help that man! Do not stop! Well, I mean, I at least respect him for running with him. I thought he was going to be driving in the Jeep. If you want to serve in the That's true. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I have some serious respect for that. I wonder if this is like a real, like they really use the, this is like, like a, a real, real training place. ground. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, possibly. This is brutal, dude. Never thought I'd it's a the good leader. Coming on 23 minutes. That is there a time limit? For the rest of the yeah, what the heck? Is there a time limit? Uh. I just had someone talking to me about their PT, like one of the ground people. And it's like crazy, man. These, with all their gear and stuff. Like, oh, yeah. Crazy. And it, I mean, maybe I'm wrong, but I feel like the gear's only gotten heavier. Yeah. <laughs> or more anyway. They like do it they like do it daily too or something. Jeez. They're like all drunk and stuff. Mission is paid, sir. Mission granted. Sir, we got nine companies, sir. Well, I come we're the only company marching every Friday night, twelve miles full pack in the pitch dark. Lieutenant Sobel hates us, sir. <laughs> I mean maybe a little bit. Possibly. That might be the case. Lieutenant Silver does not hate Easy Company, Private Ryan. Maybe he just loves us. <laughs> he just hates you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Who is this? Christensen. Why is there no water in your can? Oh, shoot. Yes, Lieutenant Winter. Yes, That's sir. Michael Fassbender. This man That's Magneto, bro. not drink from his canteen during the Friday night march? He was, sir. Private Christensen, you have disobeyed. <sighs> Oh my oh gosh. My. You're late and you allow troopers to disobey direct orders? Bro. No excuse, sir. You're making me look bad, Lieutenant. That's a little unfair. Yeah, maybe that's the point of it. This is easy company. And under my command, this will be the first and finest company now in this It's like regiment. he's not taking responsibility yeah. a little bit. They're infractions and your disciplinary recommendations on my uh, desk. Oh zero my gosh, shoot. Is that clear? Find some. Dang, that's hard. And he's worried about his looks too. Well, uh, you're you're turning him against his men almost. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, it just doesn't like. There's like a, you know, a sense of like harshness and like, you know, being you know being a jerk or whatever. But he's going a little like. Are you trying to get yourself killed? No, sir. Stand in the door. Yeah, maybe there is something to it. I mean, he's being like brutal, but maybe there is something to it. Yeah, yeah, I mean, possibly. I mean, listen, at the end of the day, this is the military. Like, it is. It, it, it is. Nice. Like, and at the end of the day, we're preparing for war, right? So yeah, that's also war not war nice. Oh, oh that was cool. cool. <laughs> 50 minutes to the top and back, and I will be watching you. What are you waiting for? Dang, bro. Uh, 
15 minutes. It took him 23 minutes just to get to the top. Come on, bro. You got this. Here's the thing he's supposed to do it with all this stuff on. I think the worst part is doing it alone. <laughs> oh, that's sick. That's sick. Easy Company has the finest performance record in the entire 2nd Battalion. Isn't that Lieutenant Winters leading Easy Company in PT? Yes, sir. Yeah, that's true. I'm giving him a set of these today. Why don't you do it? He'd be proud to get them from you. <laughs> I don't know about that. Also, the... The problem is that... Pornography! Contraband! Shoot, bro. Oh, no. Non-regulation clothing. Contraband. I feel like he's kind of just doing stuff now. Yeah, like, now I feel like he's like... just... How is it private... Private Tipper has spare time for so much correspondence? Shoot, bro. Yeah, now he's just effing with him. These men aren't paratroopers yet, Lieutenant. They have no personal property. And I will not tolerate thievery in my unit. Whose footlocker is this? Private Parks, sir. Get rid of him. Oh, gosh. Dang, really? All weekend passes are canceled, officers included. Shoot. Carry on. See, like, my issue, though, is that it feels like he's not doing it for them. He's, like, doing it for him. For him. Yeah, yeah there's a point at which it becomes sadistic. Like, it becomes yeah. self-serving instead of... The necessary evil, so to speak. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Uh, yeah. And as a test of your oh, organizational man. skills and Great. potential, I am designating you mess officer for 14 days. There's rain forecast tomorrow, so the company will have a light afternoon of lecture and classroom instruction. I think a, a special meal before their afternoon off would be a welcome change of pace. Would you agree? Yes, sir. I mean, that's good, but he's... He's just putting him through the ringer. Yeah, I feel like... Even this, like, why are you giving him spaghetti here? You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a little, like... Yeah. Like, the way he said it, too, like, special meal. Like, yeah. what are you talking about? Like, I don't get it. Almost sounds like you poisoned it, you know? Like, I wouldn't, <laughs> even, be, I wouldn't even be surprised. Like, what, why are you speaking like this? Spaghetti ain't supposed to be This ain't spaghetti. This is army noodles with ketchup. Jeez. You ain't gotta eat it. Oh, oh my gosh, gosh, bro. He's gonna make him run. What a that's that's messed up, dude. Yo, man. You like that? It doesn't get any worse than that's that. That's so messed up. Like. Gonna say they have it off and then change it. Oh, jeez, bro. You you do not deserve to get your way. Randleman, you look tired. It's like instead of wanting them to the the like keep it up and like actually make it, it's almost like you want them to fail. He wants you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. literally, like I just want you to fail and that's it. That's right, you don't you don't give in to him, man. <laughs> We, we need a new guy, man. Like, is he going to be leading us? Like, I mean, they said seven to two, how many days they said? I, I, I can't remember seven or two, 200. Something. I don't remember. Anyway, a long amount of days that we're stuck with this guy. 712 so, or something. I think That's it was, insane. right? This will be the first of five exits from a C-47 aircraft. Yeah, this is the real hard part today. of it. So Freaking I'm assuming football they, helmets. they have practice already? Oh, okay, we're already like we're doing real stuff here. Okay. Because they're jumping from so low, they deploy immediately. I'm assuming. Possibly. It I'm seems not sure unusual to me, but was that? Is that the guy? The yeah, that's the 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 lieutenant. The leader guy. Yeah. Rest assured, any refusals in the aircraft or at the door, you're out. And I guarantee you, you will. Yeah. Dang. Get out of the airborne. Dang, you, you've come so far. Don't do it. Okay. Okay. 
Alright, we did one, dude. Four more. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I like the way they're shooting it. It looks like real... Yeah, it looks cool. It looks like real footage. Yeah, it does. I just think, if you had any class or style like me, someone might mistake you for somebody. You mean like your fucking sergeant? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Are those dusty jump wings? <laughs> oh, jeez, bro. He's gonna walk it. Yeah, oh no. Three miles up, three miles down. Uh, he's gonna ruin this, too. He ruins everything. Yeah. We can't even have this. Oh, okay. oh no, it's not Okay, now. okay. And I, you can't blame me for being worried, bro. Well, at ease, paratroopers. See, you wouldn't have said that. <laughs> By God, the 506 is going to forge that brand new concept into Victor. Yeah! I want you to know that I'm damn proud of each and every one of you. Now, you deserve this party. Karahe! This is just, uh... This is like training. Yeah, right? like, uh... Yeah. I don't know what they're training for, but... I don't know. I feel like there's more to this 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 lieutenant this than, main than guy. Yeah. Guy. That's true. I, uh, I'm down uh, to see. I, I mean, even just acting like that, it's like he's. I don't know. He just. He seems very like. Expo position for ambush, sir. We should sit tight. Let the enemy team come in our killing zone. They're right up there somewhere. Let's just get him. Bro, whoa, where are you? Whoa, whoa, whoa! He seems really. Oh, jeez. Uh, uh, why did? Why Wait, does he have up. to be in charge? Move out. What a tactical guard. And I, I like seeing the second lieutenant just have to be like, look, dude, this is what we got to do. Orders yeah. are orders. Yeah, dude, what? What are you doing, bro? Captain, you've just been killed along with 95% of your company. Yeah, what the heck was that? Easy company, 2nd Battalion, 506. Yeah, you're making us look bad. Not just look Captain. bad. Like, bro, I'm thinking, like, you're going to get us killed in the battlefield. Like... You, you, you. Dude, I'd be, I'd be like, bro, what are you doing? Eh, uh, what are you gonna do? Nothing. Just keep training the man. You learn him pretty quickly. Uh, no flaws, no vices, no sense of humor. <laughs> Just like your chums of a battalion staff. I'm hearing a lot of rumblings. Sobel? Mm. Just talking about that. Mm. So, he gets a little jumpy in the field. Mm -hmm. He gets jumpy and then you get killed. <laughs> That's nice. He's good at one maneuver. Well, you know, I'm always fumbling with grenades. It'd be easier if one went off by accident, you know? Jeez. Now they must have put him in charge. I mean, look, that's not nothing to keep in mind, even as higher command, right? Well, it's like, bro, yeah. Like, listen, you can't even blame him. Like, he's doing the same thing to them, of you course. know? It's like. Trip ship, England. I like these two. We're leaving Europe, my friend. Fortress Europa. <laughs> Morning. Oh. <laughs> He's like finally in the room. Uh, somebody that shares my tendencies. Wait, is he really going to be in charge? I guess so. Wow. This is actually frequent letters of love and a This is where it's like it's so bad. Um, the fighting heart once you get on the field, with that, you might need to like switch up the chain of command real quick. You know look, what I'm saying? Like, he may be unfit. Yeah, it's like it's too much. That's cool. Right in through these trees. At the same time, our second platoon in this particular case. <laughs> hey, I love the editing. Oh, <laughs> nice shot. They look, this one's really like I don't know, like practical or well done. The effects. Are yeah, nice. I think they are, dude. Sobel's leg. Great. 
There should be no fence here. You're okay, exposed. But adapt to it. Just. Dude, you're so exposed. Look at this. We're just sitting in the middle of a freaking Tommy, field. Plus. Get the men. Get them. Take cover behind those trees. He feels so like, um. Like he can't think under pressure. There should be no, yeah. There should be no fence here. Um, and he can't adapt to certain situations. Like he's just like, oh, what do I do? That's not the point. Where the goddamn, where the goddamn hell are? Bro, but it's like, is this gonna happen to you when yeah, you run into in a combat? Yeah, like, a fence uh, in freaking Germany. Like, like. Uh, it's a wild bear <laughs> crap in the woods. Oh, son. That's good. I get a good man. You can goose this smuck. Get us moving. No, 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 no. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. dude, really? Oh no. Just this watch. Dang, bro. Is there a problem, Captain Sobo? Who said that? Who broke silence? I think it's Major Horton, sir. <laughs> Major Horton? What, what is he? Did he join us? I think maybe he's moving. The I like how these guys like <laughs> going along with it. Hold up, Mr. Sobo. <laughs> guys, shut up. Offense! Say, um. <laughs> Above wire fence! Oh, oh dude, he freaking knows! <laughs> yeah, he's, he's, he's helping us out. To get this goddamn platoon on the move! Yes, sir! Left with second, I'll be right up the middle with third. Go. Yes, dude, this guy sounds way more Dude, he's, he's calm. He's like... Now, look, you never know when people get into combat, but he's so... He's such a great leader. Yeah, I mean, so far he looks better than the other guy. Let's just say that. Oh, well, I mean, anybody looks better than the other guy. Who's this? <laughs> He's like, oh, bro, I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to be in the middle of this. I just want to freaking go on a bike ride. Holy. Get the civilian into cover! <laughs> You've done it now, Yanks. You've captured me. <laughs> oh, bro. Would that be the enemy? Uh, yep. Kind of. <laughs> who was the idiot who cut that man's fence? I was ordered to, sir. By who? Major oh, no! The <laughs> <laughs> Do that. Yes, sir. Major Horton ordered you to cut the fence. <laughs> yes, he did. Major Horton is on leave in London. Dang. Oh, he's gonna freaking lit. take it out on oh, them, though. No. <laughs> That's Simon Pegg, by the way, dude, as his second in command. Isn't that crazy? Oh, is it? Yeah, bro. I just recognize him. He looks super young and he's. He's pulling off an American accent. Darn well. But that's Simon Fe Look at it. It is. Oh my gosh. Now that you said it. With Captain Sobel's compliments, sir. <laughs> it's so weird here. Now it feels American. a little strange. Lieutenant. He's not doing a funny. Oh, for crying out loud. He spelled court martial. Oh, no. Wow. Serious? For but I mean, for oh, what? Gosh. Like, is there a serious enough offense? The trains at 10 hundred hours. From 0930 to 0955, I was censoring the enlistment's mail by order of Colonel Strayer. At 10 hundred hours, I followed your orders to the minute. I'm courted with a family that has no telephone. And sent a runner. No runner found me, Captain. Irregardless. What do you irregardless. What that, are you What do you mean, irregardless? Me? What are you talking about? Well, to let such a failure of duty by my own XO go unpunished. So he's being court martialed. Are you kidding me, bro? For not cleaning the toilets? Bro, like, you're ridiculous. Punishment for your offenses will be denial of a 48 hour pass for 60 days. Oh. Stay before we add attention. Dude, he's on a power trip, bro. Of appeal and request and his a trial by his court ego has just been hurt. Do a trial by court martial. Screw him. That's stupid. This is, this is ridiculous. Spend your weekends on the base anyway, Dick. Be a man. Take the punishment. May I borrow your pen, sir? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I request trial by court martial. Is this guy's this guy's legit? Bro. I love winters. I love winters. Good for him. Well, Nixon better find a loophole to get him out. And if he don't, 
Winner scrambles eggs while the rest of us make the big jump with Sobel. Yeah, we can't have that. Yeah, can they help somehow? Probably not. So we're going through with this, right? We gotta do something. We could be lined up against the wall and shot. Oof. I'm ready to face that. And every one of us had better be too. Yeah, but for, for I that. will not follow that man. Yeah, you're combat. you're gonna you're gonna do the same thing basically, following that guy. As a non-commissioned officer. If enough people do it, maybe they'll do like an investigation. An easy combat. Probably, I mean, because it's like, why are all these guys yeah. not wanting to follow you, bro? Like, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right, because what, 10, 15 guys? So, Randy. Sir. You consider yourself lucky I'm only busting you to private. All of you NCOs have disgraced behind... Are you going to pay attention, though? ...yourself lucky that we are on the eve of the largest action in the history of warfare, which leaves me no choice but to spare your life. Get. Come on. <laughs> For the man. Heck yeah. Does he know what they did? No. I think he's suspicious now. I believe just a few of the sergeants may have felt their loyalty lay more to the platoon than to the company. And these few sergeants convinced all of the other NCOs in your company to turn in their stripes. Mm -hmm. As staff sergeants, they have a great amount of influence, sir. But as I say, the rest are good men. I know them. I, I can work with them. Nah, dude, you just want your position. You can't. You, you can't lead these men. Come on. This business of the winter's court martial has been an unpleasant distraction. Indeed, indeed it has, sir. Your command of Easy Company has been exemplary. Thank, thank you, sir. Hmm. I believe you fielded one of the finest companies of soldiers I've ever seen. Division has established a parachute training school at Chilton Foley. Hmm. Or non-infantry types who were vital to the coming invasion. He's going to doctors, him. yeah. Chaplains to take jump training there. Frankly, I can't think of anyone more qualified <laughs> to command <laughs> such a school than you are. Good for him. I'm reassigning you to Chilton Foley. But in, in like a good, like you didn't cause a problem. Yeah, that's that's smart. But like we all know why. Yeah. It's like when you pressure someone to fight or to quit. War if it needs you elsewhere. Is who who will be replacing me? Winters. Lieutenant Meehan from Baker <laughs> Company is senior. Okay. Hmm. Good luck at Chilton Foley at Herbert. Don't let us down now. Already back. I'm dying to get my hands on a real Luger. Yeah, go on in. Quick folks, you did. <laughs> He's like, I have no idea what you're saying, but I want to hold this Luger. Boy, she sure is a doozy. Hey, fuck her in there. What? Hi. <laughs> hey, Patty. Bro, this is the, the, the <laughs> most funny. British guy ever. You're having a ball if you take her off, isn't you not? Yeah, sorry. Hey, good luck. Hey, say, Mike. Huh. Never put yourself in a position where you can take from these men. <laughs> I really like that. I really like seeing how much he cares. Yeah. Then we turn left. Yeah. Bearing 042, 12 minutes. Then another left. Green light, right over Ramsbury. Ramsbury. Every single time. Linear distance on the grid of about... I like seeing a unit that actually works well together now. It's Normandy. <laughs> Saint-Marie Dumont, causeway number one, causeway number two. The ultimate field problem. Continuous beachhead. Omaha and Utah into one continuous beachhead. Each trooper will... I didn't know we had... It. They did airborne troops too. That's crazy. Yeah, I think we did the bombing and stuff too, right? We will drop behind this Atlantic wall five hours before the 4th Infantry lands at Utah. So Chief of the Kokomo Police Department. <laughs> Whoa. You gotta love Dang, bro. That's sick. 
You did not sign your GI life insurance. <laughs> you go on over and see Sergeant Evans at the headquarters company tent. You boys don't let your families miss out on $10,000. My wife keeps up with things back home, casualty list and like that. Oh no. Oh, his brother shit. Died. You know his brother in Italy? Henry? Killed in Monte Casino. Mm. You tell him that right now? I'm sure he doesn't know. Don't tell him like that right now. You can not right now. Today, as you read this, you're en route to the great adventure for which you have trained for over two years. <laughs> That's why he gave us ice cream. <laughs> Easy company! Listen up! Channel Coast is socked in with rain and fog. No jump tonight. The invasion has been pulled. I like I like seeing the like catching up to this now. That's really yeah, yeah, cool. Yeah. Something happened to me. Got the wrong goddamn jacket. Oh, oh no. shoot. I was struck by lightning. Oh no. Oh Bill Garnier is Oh he, he didn't he slipped it in there. Uh, this is, uh, I don't know, man, that's... You got something you might be looking for. To get jacket by mistake. Sorry. You ready? Oh, wait, no, it wasn't. He actually man. did. I don't know, at least some way. Uh, maybe he'll be more ready to kill some... Sorry about your brother. Nazis. Sorry for my mom. He was, uh... I'll meet up with you over there. Dang. What a, what a good freaking leader. Like, like... It's just no better man to, to go into combat with. What, and, like, all these guys are probably gonna be able to fight harder knowing that Yeah, he's that he's leader. got their back. Whereas, like, if they had, you know... What's oh, his name? Sobel? Sobel? No way. I mean, not even... The whole platoon would be not effective on a mental level you know i like seeing how much gear they have like yeah, like yeah, seeing yeah. how like they literally can't get up the steps with it look at this it's crazy there's like a grain over everything they 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 i think they work to make it look a little bit like actual footage oh really it looks like it I, f I feel like i'm seeing something maybe i'm crazy dang can you imagine being the guys left behind it's okay bro you're good I like how shaky they're making everything. Mm. <laughs> That's sick. What a great first episode. That was good, yeah. That was like a short film in and of itself. Kind of was, yeah. Which I really like. I think that's the approach. And I'm I'm, I'm really invested in these characters. I'm assuming we're going to be following these guys throughout D-Day and, and then the aftermath. I would hope so. I mean... Uh, but it's it's so... It's such an effective way. I like that we start with D-Day and then we come back to D-Day. I don't know. It's... Like I said, it, it it's very contained. It feels like a short film in and of itself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, for sure. Yeah, and I like the little the little struggles that they were having. Um, pretty actually getting into the war, you know? Yeah. Having to deal with, you know, someone who wasn't that good of a leader, causing some issues and stuff like that. Yeah, and even and understanding they, your duty in, in all of that. Yeah, and then how they kind of deal with it. It was cool, you know? Um, I like that, you know, what they showed wasn't... 
how should I say? Like, it was an actual issue rather than just being too sensitive. Like, yeah. I feel like a lot of times, you know, you know, you look at, like, the drill sergeants and stuff like that. And relative to, like, regular life, you know, it can feel so much more, um, Brutal. you know, yeah, like, harsh. Yeah. You know, and you're like, why do you have to do certain things? But obviously, um, you do and things like it's that. like it's like in glory it's like you're preparing these men for war it, it, it's not about being nice yeah or fair even and 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 you're doing them that service right yeah. it's like it and it may seem not seem like that does everybody do it because of that no are some people on power trips like sobel or maybe even a lot less dramatic than sobel right? yeah, a lot less yeah dramatic. for sure yeah uh but it still doesn't mean that a it doesn't need to be done and b it's not going to save your life on the battlefield yeah, yeah, but I do think that, like, what they showed was kind of, like, what could happen if someone who actually was taking it too far... Of course. ...was in that position, right? Of and course. it was. It was taking it too far in a way. So I like that it was a little more realistic in that way. Um, yeah, I, I like that, too. It doesn't it doesn't kind of, like, over-glorify... The, I mean, look, these things are only as good as the people in them, and, and there aren't always good people in them. Yeah, and, and I like how the, the top guy dealt with it. I like how um, everyone seems very, like all the reactions and things like that seem very natural. Yeah. Um, obviously, you got to tone it down a little bit, but like, you know, I hope that we keep to that kind of like consistency with, you know, the the nature of the characters and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm really interested to see Winters in action. I I, I, I see love in him. Action. I feel like he's a little bit of the main character. Maybe not. Maybe it is more the ensemble. I feel like they're they're at least focusing on him a little bit more. Kind of uh, feels that way. Just as like the commanding officer, I suppose, or one of the commanding officers, yeah. lieutenant, right, lieutenant? I don't I think so. Remember, anyway, I don't know. Um, I just think he's a very interesting character, and I think you don't you don't always see a lot of characters like that, like that kind of quieter, maybe less like charismatic, less kind of dramatic. He's just very like silent and and contemplative, but good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, that's true. I'm, I'm interested in seeing him kind of like struggle with certain things. Yeah, and I'm really excited to see where the show goes. I mean, like, it, stuff happened, but at the same time, like, no fighting happened in a certain sense. So I'm very excited mm-hmm. to see where we go from here. Um, as I was, full-length reaction is going to be up with the Patreon. The next week's reaction, episode two, is going to be up for early access. If you guys want to go ahead and check that out. And yeah, thank you just for being here. Thank you for joining us, for watching. If you guys are new to the channel, uh, welcome. Hopefully you stick around. We would love to have you with us. And if you do, we will see you all in the next video.